Hi, this is John Leone, Essential Software Products, and uh, today we're doing a little tutorial um, of our flagship product, Essential Video Recorder. Now, uh, the first button you see here is a reset that's used uh, when you're switching cameras or for some reason the screen uh, freezes, you can just uh, reset all your hardware. The most common uh, time in this is we have three cameras hooked up here. And say we uh, remove one and then go to pick it, we'll get a blank screen. Click reset, and now it'll show that we just have two cameras. Then when you plug it back in, if I can get it back in. Ah, there it goes. Uh, click uh, reset again, and there are three cameras. And he's outside my house, he's down my hallway. This is a 270, but uh, we're gonna have to let's go back to the head on. There we go. Now, the, the next button on the list is incognito. Uh, what incognito does, it just removes all the screen controls. If for some reason you just want to see a video stream pristine, you can do it that way. There are reasons to do it at some point, but it's something I rarely use myself. Um, then this is a, a brand new button. Actually, it's going to be in this next release. Uh, I don't know. We're on beta 7.3, I think, up now. This was I uh, wrote this for um, a program that today is. Uh, it's first day, it's going to certification. Uh, it's uh, essential time lapse video. It makes time lapse videos. It builds off this stuff, but instead of making a recording of a video, it does uh, a series of bitmap images, uh, bitmap images, and uh, then renders them into a time lapse video. But uh, that being neither here nor there, this is the help button. And it'll go to the Essential Video Recorder page. Of note, this picture here will be being replaced by this video. So this way, if you come, you see a video, you see how everything works. And it's a quick link to the, uh, you know, the frequent asked questions. I can help you brush those up a little. And um, and this is the new product I was talking about. And it has a video already here and. You know, some of the basics, but that's another part. Okay, and then when you're done with whatever you got to do, you go back to the program. And uh, now here's start recording. Now with start recording, let me, uh, you just go into videos. Um, the videos folder itself um, is where these videos go. This is essential video two, three, four. These are for quick one-offs. You don't want to pick a file name or anything else. Uh, you just click start recording. And then here you see essential video 5, MP4. And, uh, you know, you record whatever, blah, 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 blah. You click stop recording. And uh, over here... Uh, and here's the video, and then you play it, and recording, and then here you see essential video 5, and you know what videos, and videos, and videos, it gets a little crazy. Um, and then here you can pick a file name, say it's not a quick one-off, and you're working on a project, you probably do want to use a file name. Uh, you could, uh, hmm. Okay, you put in the videos, and it doesn't have to be videos, it could be in desktop. Uh, test uh, essential video recorder. And then we'll hit enter, and we'll put uh, video. Let's see. And then we'll hit start recording. And blah, 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 blah. This is John's video. Then when you hit stop recording, it goes uh, to that location. Uh, the location would be in videos. And uh, 
guess size your video recorder and here's your video and then you can play it why not or we'll play it again over again videos and videos of it this will be added. Um, okay so that's this stuff we already went over the selection of cameras of note what's uh, improved Ah, sorry, I'm thirsty. It's like the 10th take of it. Um, it improves like if you have two of the same cameras, it'll increment it, or three, it'll increment it to three. Um, this is two 920s and a 270. Uh, the other thing is the next screen. This shows uh, the capabilities of whatever camera selected. 920s are a bit uh, higher res than. Uh, 270s, so here you got 1920 by 1080 which is HD, and, uh, and you go here, and this only is 1280 by 960 down the hall. And if I go find out one of the best, and uh, then we can't uh, forget the most important button of all <laughs> make donations. And uh, I give the option of one, two, or three dollars. And uh, if this product helps you, I mean, help me by you know making me, uh, you know, make some money so I can afford to make more of this stuff. And uh, you know, but it's a donation. Uh, I mean, uh, you know, if you can, it's much appreciated. And if you can't, it's understood. And you know, but it, if it turns into you know, one of my products is a regular in your lineup. It, it would be nice if you pull me up, even if it's only a dollar. It would be appreciated. And it's just appreciated that you use my software and stuff, too. Okay, uh, I think that's it. Oh, I forgot the most important uh, recent development. <laughs> this. Isn't that something? <laughs> I just love that used to have a button here for different screen sizes it was you know it was a couple of versions ago but it was uh it was a much better improvement anyway that'll do it uh thank you and uh have a pleasant evening